Dancing the Viennese Waltz. Audrey Harrison and Natalie Lowe. grace yes. about it when he so moves his arms and all that it's beautiful Alicia starts off oh, Audley I much prefer you in ballroom dancing Every, you had such nice control everything was well placed carefully placed without looking too contrived or forced I just want you to push it a little bit more really take ownership of the dance and feel confident leading Natalie around because you're getting there you're so charming really endearing as well and you should be proud you did a very good job yeah I agree yeah. I agree <laughs> now then Rudolph. I have no idea you could be so delicate, so yeah. careful, so caring. You treated her like a princess, like a precious china doll. You loved every moment to be when you were with her. I could see the connection. You were pretty and very, very beautiful. You have to be careful, though. The drive. On the Venice Wolf, there's a continuous drive through the dance, yeah? So you never stop the moves. At times, you kind of stopped a little bit. It looked like you were walking, but overall, a very, very good effort. Well done. Thank you. See, what did I tell you? What did I tell you? OK, now then, Craig. Just a few little pointers, darling. When you do step turn, step you need to spot with your head. Your hands still need shaping. I can see you have been working on it, though. Uh, your head position uh, in the natural turn was a bit funky. Uh, it's doing some very odd things, as is your tongue, darling. This seemed to be a loss of the tongue. I don't know why, but I couldn't watch your footwork because your tongue kept hanging out of your head. Uh, just a bit, just a bit. <laughs> no, the, my, the point is, Natalie didn't tread on it. <laughs> OK, so carry on, Craig, you were finished. Oh, no, darling, it could take all night. Oh. <laughs> oh, that's, that's not right. Jennifer, finish us off, if you well, will. I thought it was oddly enchanting. Oh, oh. Yes. I thought it was a great mix of masculinity and elegance, which is a great feat considering you have size 16 shoe. 17. 17. 17. Okay, yeah. I just, it's crazy. It's crazy town. Okay, <laughs> but I did, did think you could use a little bit more fire and it, to be a little more dynamic, like take charge of the dance and be the master of it. But he does have a certain grace about oh, it, which I love. Does. We all love it. Everybody loves it. <laughs> Yes, you brought the A game tonight, Audley. Yeah. Enchanting, endearing. Have you ever been called delicate before? 
Um, you have now? No. <laughs> <laughs> Bruno says you're delicate. I mean, you've been bottom two a couple of times. Some mixed comments from the judges, but that is not going to wipe that smile off your face. No, is definitely. It? I mean, we danced that dance very well, I thought, so uh, mm. I'm very happy with that dance. That yeah. smile is your secret <laughs> weapon, Audley, now. Forget the fierce, this is a smile. Look, what's Craig talking about? We can't see the tongue. Yeah, it's behind yeah. the teeth. Well, there it is. About the tongue. <laughs> Poor tongue. Oh. The scores are in. Craig, Craig. Ladies and gentlemen, the judges' scores. Craig Revel Horwood. Five. <laughs> Jennifer Gray. Eight. <laughs> Alicia Dixon. Seven. Bruno Tonio. Seven. That's 27. And eight there. That's a high five, eight from Jennifer. That's our highest score today. So Is it your highest score today? That's our yes. highest score today. Good oh, yeah. man, Audley.